What's up, CompSci community? We're back with exercise number two in the third chapter of starting out with Python. Exercise number two in chapter three is called areas of rectangles. And it says the area of a rectangle is the rectangle's length times its width. Write a program that asks for the length and width of two rectangles. The program should tell the user which rectangle has the greater area or if the areas are the same. So I put a couple comments in here just to kind of outline the program, what's needed to actually complete this. So the first step is to ask the user for the length and width of two rectangles. So I'm going to say length one is of type int. Take the input and we're going to ask the user what is the length of rectangle one. Okay. Now I'm just going to copy this and paste this because the other uh, prompts are very similar. Oh, I just realized I missed a parenthesis. I got to add that. Recopy this. Okay. Now I'm going to change this to width, width one. And what is the width? of rectangle one. Now this is length two, width two, what is the length of rectangle two, and what is the width of rectangle two. So now that we have all of our inputs asking the user for the lengths and widths of both rectangles, now we can actually calculate the area. So we're going to say uh, rectangle one Rectangle, oh boy, rectangle one equals length one times width one. And rectangle, rectangle two equals length two times width two. So now that the area of both of the rectangles are calculated, now we can compare the two and see which one is larger or if they're the same size. So let's say if rectangle one is equal to rectangle two, print both rectangles are the same size. Elif rectangle one is greater than rectangle two. Print rectangle one is larger than rectangle 2. Else print rectangle 2 is larger than rectangle 1. Okay. Okay, that's it. Let's save this and run it and let's see what happens. What is the length of rectangle one? Five. What is the width of rectangle one? Four. What is the length of rectangle two? Ten. And what is the width of rectangle two? Let's call it two. And it says both re rectangles are the same size. Uh, that, and that's what we should get. But let's try and get a different result here. Let's do five and four again. Ten and three. Rectangle 2 is larger than rectangle 1. So this tells us exactly what we want, if one is larger or if they're the same size. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you liked it, be sure to hit the like button below and subscribe if you want more videos like this. Alright, well thank you guys so much for watching. Take care.